Hey, welcome back to Suzy Scrap and Spot. In my video tutorial today, I'm going to show you how to import SVG files. Okay, if we just go right up here to our SVG and click that button, it's going to ask you where your SVG files are stored. Mine are in my library, so I'm going to click on Libraries and in my Documents and under Cricut SVGs. Now, I made this folder, Chris, Cricut SVGs. You can set this up however you want and I'll show you how to do that in another tutorial. So if I click on there, then I've got mine broken down into categories just because it's easier for me to find things that way. Let's just go to flowers and if you'll notice to the right there is a preview screen so you can see what it is you're pulling up and if you want to turn that off all you do is click preview. So we're just going to choose a flower so you just click on it, make sure it's highlighted and hit open and there it is and then you can go right here to remember your key proportions you always want to check that and then you can size it however big or small you want and let's say you want another one the exact same size all you do is right click hit copy right click hit paste and then you can move it over and you can do that over and over and over again if you'd like Okay. now if I want to import another one a different flower and you don't have to keep it the same size on the second one actually you can make that one bigger this program is so user friendly you can do whatever you want okay so if I click SVG again and let's just choose another flower let's choose that one and click open and this one is huge well, I don't want it this big so I'm going to go over hit keep proportions and then just change this to five and then it resizes it down. You can resize it from there with your nodes, whatever you want to do. It just is easier to hit your sizing right here instead of trying to go find this corner um, because when it's really big like that, it's kind of hard to find. So that's just a, a simpler way to do that. Okay, and let's add one more. We want a whole mat full of flowers. Okay, open. Okay, that one's really huge again. Again, hit keep proportions. And we'll just go with five. And then hit your tab key after you hit five so it knows that you're serious about it. You're not just playing with the numbers. And move it around and then you can resize or whatever you want to do. That's as easy as it is to import SVG files. You just hit your SVG with the little plus sign and it'll import them right onto your mat. You can choose as many different um, flowers or you can mix and match, you can have flowers and then go over here to text and start typing some text and let's just do, I don't know, sunny day and then go up to our pointer and hit keep proportions and resize and you can cut all of this in one swipe you don't have to do one piece and then another piece that is what I love about sure cuts a lot, you can mix and match and cut it all at the same time if you want so that's all there is to importing SVGs. Thanks for stopping by.